Hello friends, in this video I am going to show you how to install Anaconda with Python 3. So let's get started. First what you need to do is you need to search Anaconda Python. Okay, you will get a link over here which is continuum.io slash downloads. Click on this link and it will take you to this web page. I am going to show you how to install and download and install for Windows. If you are running Mac or Linux system click on these icons so let's click on Windows icon and guys I'm going to show you how to install Python 3 with Anaconda so we are going to click on either of these link if you are running 32 bit operating system click on this link and if you are running 64 bit operating system click on this button okay let's click on 64 bit installer because I'm running 64 bit operating system and guys it will start downloading over here ok I am going to cancel this because I have already downloaded this package and your downloaded package will be in download folder my package I have moved my package from download folder to desktop so let's double click on it and it will start the installation process ok it will be a normal installation process just click on next agree next next make sure this two box is checked now click on install and guys it will take some time because it is a very heavy package it starts downloading or uh, it start installing every pack famous package of python onto your system uh, so be patient about it because depending upon your operating system and your uh, laptop or pc's configuration it will take around 15 to 20 minutes so I will be fast forwarding this installation process now and I will be back as soon as the installation is done. So guys as you can see Anaconda is completely installed onto my system. Let's click on next and uncheck this box and click on finish. So guys, your Anaconda is completely installed with Python 3. So guys, to access Anaconda, what you need to do is you need to click on start menu, click on all programs, look for Anaconda 3 folder, open this folder and click on Anaconda navigator. Okay? So guys it will take some time to open up this because it tries to update the packages which it has installed while the installation process. So just wait for it and I am going to show you which ID you have to open to run your python code. Okay. So guys as you can see there are three software for you, um, for you to run a python notepad book, uh, qt console or spider. I am going to show you how to uh, how to run your program using spider just click on launch and what it is going to do it is going to open up a spider 3 for you so just wait for it okay as you can see guys it has opened the spider okay now I'm going to show you how you can run your beautiful soup code onto this spider I have already written the code just click I'm going to uh, open that code onto spider click on file open my code is over here demo.py I'm going to open this okay where is my code okay I just deleted the code just I'm going to qu quickly write this uh, beautiful soup code okay So guys, this is our a small beautiful soup code. What I'm going to do over here is I'm going to open up this uh, Twitter handle, uh, Twitter handle of a Twitter. So let's first of all run this program. Okay, to run this program, what you need to do is you need to either you can click on this particular play button or click on run, and and again on the run. And guys, as you can see, you will get your output on this console window over here. Okay so just wait for it and guys as you can see we have completely downloaded our twitter ha 
Twitter handle of a Twitter dot com. So guys, in this way you can run your beautiful soup code inside a spider. If you are trying to run beautiful soup uh, without this anaconda, you will get some error. So I will suggest you to run your beautiful soap code inside this anaconda. Okay, so that's it for this video, guys. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye, guys.